It's just right there. The most high told you out his own mouth, right? The most high told you. He say, you know what I'm saying? That uh he deal with he he reveals himself, right, through visions and he speaks through the through the dreams. Then Job told you he he was he was revealed, you know what I'm saying, the the uh that the most high revealed himself to Job in a vision. Right? Then uh Abraham, the most high revealed himself to Abram in a vision. Right? So let's go to uh let's get one more. We're gonna go with first Samuel. Alright, here we go, right here, right. Alright, we're gonna end it with this one right here. This uh first Samuel chapter three. Say the last Samuel was serving Yahweh before Eli. The word of Yahweh was scarce in those days. Vision was not widespread. See, say verse two. It happened one day that Eli was lying in his place. His eyes had begun to become dim. He could not say he could not see. The lamp of Yahweh had not gone out yet and not yet gone out. And Samuel was lying in the temple of Yahweh where the ark of Yah uh, the ark of God was. Say so Yahweh called to Samuel. Yahweh called to Samuel and he said, Here I am. And he ran to Eli and said, So he went and lay down. So he went and lay down. Yahweh continued to call Samuel. And Samuel rose and went to Eli and said, Here I am. For you called me, but he said, I did not call you, my son. Go back and lay down. Samuel had not yet known Yahweh, and the word of Yahweh had not been revealed to him. Yahweh continued to call Samuel a third time. And he rose and he went to Eli and said, Here I am, for you called me. Then Eli realized that Yahweh was calling the lad. And Eli said to Samuel, Go lay down. And he said, and if he calls you again, say, and if he call you, you should say, speak, Yahweh, for your servant is listening. Samuel went and lay down in his place. Yahweh came and appeared and called as the other time, Samuel, Samuel. And Samuel said, and Samuel said, speak, for your servant is listening. All right. See, so we see again here. Right? Samuel was laying in bed. He was saying Samuel was lying in the temple of Yahweh where the ark was. Right? So he was in a high state of mind, man. Right? Where the Most High could deal with him. Right? And the Most High Yahweh called out to him while he was lying down. Right? See? In bed. He was lying down. So we see now that the Most High, out his own mouth, he told you. That he revealed himself through the visions and he speak through the dream, right? Then Job told you that Yahweh revealed himself to Job through a, through a vision, right? Uh, then uh, Yah came to Abraham in a vision, right? Then Yah came to set milk Moses at the burning books, you know? He came to uh, uh, Samuel in a vision, you know? He came to, you go to Ezekiel chapter 11, read uh, verses 24. Uh, he came to Ezekiel uh, in a vision, you know. Uh, uh, Daniel, Daniel chapter 4, verse 5. Uh, he say, in a dream, I saw a dream. So in a, in a vision, you know. Uh, Daniel 2 19, you know, uh, the most high revealed the mysteries to Daniel in visions and in dreams. Zechariah, you know, he was revealed in a vision in the night, you know, and the angel showed him Yahshua, the son of Jehoshadak, you know what I'm saying? The high priest, right? Uh, Daniel, uh, 2 28, right? When uh, King Nebuchadnezzar had a dream, right? King Nebuchadnezzar had a dream. Yahweh revealed a dream to him. He couldn't decipher it. 
You know what I'm saying? So, uh, Genesis chapter 41, like Nakabanaz, you know, Pharaoh had a dream. You know, the most high revealed dreams to Pharaoh. And what? Uh, he couldn't decipher. Them. So he had to have an Israelite to decipher. Them, you know what I'm saying? So we can see now clearly through scriptures, you know, because the scripture is clear. You know what I'm saying? When Paul in Acts 9, 3, you know what I'm saying? Paul said that a light from heaven came around him. You know what I'm saying? A, a, a bright light in Acts 22 and 6. He said a bright light, right? So we know this light, you know what I'm saying? It's, this is not how Yahweh dealt with, you know what I'm saying, the prophets. But through bright lights, you know what I'm saying? This is just not how it happened. He came through them and he dealt with them in visions and, and, and dreams, right? Uh, numbers. Chapter 12, verse 6, show you, Yahweh revealed thyself to them in visions. You know what I'm saying? So with that, we want to say, Barak Yahweh, Halalah Yahweh Akkad.